Today we are at West Lodge, um, which is like, I've been dying to come here and eat because I love this place. I came to the opening night party. I didn't vlog, I just took pictures and I ate. <laughs> We're here for lunch today to do a mini, a mini vlog. Mini vlog. Quick, quick working lunch. We can combine the two, why not? Yes. Right? And um, yeah, it's beautiful in here. And the, we just got a couple apps. So you just went right in there. I didn't know myself. That's the scotch egg with My the black truffle. Beautiful. I know. It's smoked and there's cumin in it. Yeah. So there's a nice pop. What's nice is just a little bit of truffle. Not too much. You get like just a tiny bit of it. It's not truffle can be very overpowering, but it's not. Yeah. Oh, it's just beautiful. I know. This is a perfect scotch egg. I'm about to try the um, the fluke ceviche. So citrusy. Yeah. Like the citrus is like bursts in your mouth, like flavor, flavor, flavor. Oh wow. So this is the buffalo tartare with foie gras. House made pickles. House made pickles. And I guess a little bit of um, cheese? No. Yeah, that's um, egg and pickled um, mustard seed. Mm. So that is quite yummy sounding. Um, buffalo can be kind of a rougher meat to chew, like it can be gamey. And that's not at all, it's just like it's perfect. And it puts a little bit of shaped foie gras on top too. Foie gras, egg, and like I said, the toasted yeah. uh, mustard seed. Oh, and so there's creative. Some, some capers in there too to just have, you just get like a bit of a pop from. Yeah. Oh, fantastic. Yeah. Fantastic. We've just been joined by uh, Marie from Nat Marie. Uh, this is cool. I know, right? I love the, the decor and the vibe in here is cool. We already got the pop not New York. Okay, I, I caught that, but very last minute. <laughs> Our mains have just arrived. They're here. And I'm so excited because it's open face, which means less, less bread. That looks fantastic, I must admit. And I had the lobster burger. Now, as most of you know, I don't eat carbs, so I'm going to have one bite with the bread, and the rest I'm going to eat without the bread. However, it comes highly recommended by a lot of different people. <laughs> So, bon appetit! So demanding! So I can say stuff about Boss Lady when she's got something in her mouth. Very good. Yeah? It's very good. Mm. You can tell they put real chunks of lobster and like mushed it together and then made a patty. So that it's not like, it's not fake lobster. Mm. <laughs> it's the real shit. <laughs> and then there's the, the um, Avocado cream underneath, and then I think there's like a citrusy mayo, and then these red onions. On the, side. And the flavors are fantastic. It looks perfect. I'm in heaven right now. <laughs> and how's your corned beef? Awesome. Put everything together, just very nice and nicely. Yeah. And the French fries? French fries, awesome. Pastrami sandwich, recommended by Hanif himself. Mm -hmm. it's, nice. it's very sweet. Oh, the bread is toasted. It's like a grilled sandwich. The meat is sweet. Is uh, that the slime? Oh, that's the sweetness. So I was like, what? what is it? Oh, you have the the slaw, the sweet slaw as well. I love that. Sweet and salty is my absolute favorite. And it's it's really nice. So this is panna cotta, served on pistachio with a little bit of blood orange. Panna. Oh my god, that tastes like the islands. It tastes like the Bahamas. Mm. Oh my god. That's good. That's good. <laughs> and this is the, um, what did you say, lemon meringue? Lemon. Wait, Adam just had an orgasm. That's oh. Not for me. I like, it's a bit it's sweeter. You it's like it? Isn't that delicious? I love lemon. This little chef, Stuart Cameron. Got he's a, he's like a thinker. Got, you know, I'm moving down the street from here in a week. I think this might be my my yeah. Just it's look for the big yellow out. doors. And just look for the those yellow doors is something else. Alright. Okay. Bye. Can you blow my whistle, baby?